Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to the world of AI. In today's short little video, I'm going to be covering the recent news from OpenAI CEO Sam Altman, in which he had stated that ChatGPT might be reaching its limits of its scaling opportunities. Now, if you guys haven't subscribed, please do so. Turn on the notification bell. And if you guys haven't seen any of my previous videos, it would mean the world if you guys can do so. With that thought, let's get right into it. So as we all know, ChatGPT is a chat bot which has been developed by OpenAI. Now, it has gained the interest of basically everyone across the world as well as it has gained a lot of investment and a lot of different applications are built off of it. And this is something that is quite revolutionary and innovated with the source of how big it has grown. Now, the CEO of OpenAI, as we know, Sam Altman, has recently stated in a recent article that the research strategy that actually produced the chatbot is no longer viable. And basically, he says that the actual future of it, of the advancement in AI, will come from different sources. And it is quite uncertain as to what it will actually come from. Now, as we know, OpenAI has done a lot of impressive things in creation of language-based AI as well as scaling up existing machine learning algos to crazy sizes. There's believing, there, there's like thoughts that has been trained off of trillions of words and text, as well as a lot of different data sets. And there's also cases where they've used different types of computer chips, which cost over a hundred million. And basically Altman believes that the further progress won't be coming from making the models bigger. And he stated that will make them bigger in other ways. And this is something that he stated recently last week. And the declaration basically suggests that a twist in the race to develop new types of AI algorithms. Now, as we know that Microsoft has used the underlying technology of ChatGPT to add a chatbot to its own Microsoft Bing. And this is something that other companies have even done with like such as Google in terms of it, how it launched Bard. And there's also startups that have been also working with different chatbots that are trying to integrate OpenAI's technology and even making it larger with different algorithms. Now, this is something that was quite unique as to what Altman had stated, but what his statement implies is that GPT-4 may be the last major advancement to emerge from OpenAI's strategy. I'm not saying, he's not trying to mean that it's not gonna come out of something else, but this is just something of what he believes as well as the strategy of what will be coming out of GPT-4 in terms of making models bigger and feeding them with more data. Now the paper also described that GPT-4 will suggest that there is diminishing returns on in terms of like how it scales up in its model size. And he also mentioned that the physical limits to how much like how much data it could be inputted into open AI and how it can build and quickly be used to make such different applications. Overall, what the CEO was basically trying to suggest is that open AI's focus as well as simply increasing the size of its language models is no longer the most effective approach. And there are better strategies out there that will continue to advance the field of artificial intelligence. Now, this was just something unique that I really wanted to point out as it's quite like unique to see someone like such as a CEO of such a big company to state such thing, something like this. And it shows that they're pushing to continuously innovate their product, not by just being like narrow minded for one product that they have, which is chat GPT. They're going to continuously work towards different AI algorithms to actually help produce and push artificial intelligence in the right possible way. And this is just something that I really wanted to emphasize guys, because it's something really cool to talk about as well as something to look forward to as what OpenAI will be doing as a company. And with that thought guys, I hope you enjoyed this little update video as well as this analysis of what he had stated. If you like things like this, definitely recommend me different articles to read as well as analysis on it. But with that thought, I'll catch you guys next time and I'll see you guys later. Peace out, fellas.